The test I'm going to be performing today is the crank test. The purpose of this test is to impart a compressive or torsional force to assess the integrity of the glenoid labrum. You would perform this test if you suspect a labral tear due to trauma to the shoulder, such as a dislocation. Um, the patient for this test will be placed in a supine position, such as he is, and then the arm will be elevated to 160 degrees of scaption and the elbow bent to 90 degrees. An axial load will be then placed through the humerus as you turn the glenohumeral joint into internal and external rotation gently. A positive result to this test would be pain and or apprehension along with a palpable or audible clicking or clunk that should be repetitive. The crank test has a sensitivity of 90 to 91% and a specificity of 85 to 93%. Hi, Matt. I'm Sarah. I'll be your physical therapist today. So, Matt, what I'm looking for is to see if you have a tear in your um, shoulder that could be causing some of the pain that you're experiencing. Um, I'm going to lift your shoulder up and then push, push through your elbow as I move your um, shoulder back and forth a little bit, okay? I want you to tell me if you have any reproduction of your symptoms as I do this, okay? So try to just relax. Push through your shoulder right here, and I'm turning your elbow and your arm in and out just like this. Do you have any pain? And I don't feel any clicking or um, feel any clicking. So this is a negative test. A positive result would be if you had clicking or pain. 